Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name's Teresa and I'm the car boot crafter and I'm coming on today with a car boot haul. So I've been to Ham's Hall car boot sale this morning and um, yeah, not a lot there I have to say. No, there was a lot of there was a lot of market and stalls, but they weren't selling what I wanted. But I did come across one market stall that had, let me just pull these out, that had these. Um, and I think these are Poundland. Um, yeah, I'm sure I've seen these in Poundland. Um, so these were 50p each and they're brand spanking new. Um, oh no, I won't open them. <laughs> I can feel that the glitter's all the way up to the lid, so I'm going to have to find a tray to, uh, yeah, it's already falling out. I'm going to find a tray to open them um, in. But yeah, so 50p each. I think they're in pound, like a pound each, something like that anyway. Um, so I thought all six for three pound wasn't bad at all. So yeah, so I've got the gold, silver, blue, pink, deeper blue and a gorgeous lush green fabulous for Christmas that green actually um, would have been nice to have had a red as well but that's the three that's the only six colors they had they also had loads of these dovecrafts and these were also 50p each but I didn't pick up any of these because I've got loads of these already so um, as you can see I keep them on the bench so yeah so those for 50p each I thought were brilliant and there's absolutely tons of glitter in there. Let me move those out of the way. And then there was a, a car booter who had um, a table which was just full of um, crafty bits. But it was it was stamps and a few, few papers and these cards. Um, and then the rest were all, uh, what do you call it? CD ROMs, which I don't really do. So uh, I kind of left them. But I did have um, some of the other bits and pieces. So these are, so these are frame cards. But it was these ones that I really was interested in, the flipping ones. Um, because I have a ton of flipping decoupages. I've got a smaller one as well. And another bigger one and these were 50p each now there is only three but they are big big cards um so let me pull one out and show you uh, that's the the docket let's get one if i pull that one out whoop, like that so what you can see is the card opens up like that and you've got the aperture through on both sides and what it is, you put a piece of acetate in and then you've got your flipping decoupage on both sides, um, which I have loads of flipping um, decoupage, that the flipping <laughs> decoupage. Um, and um, I, I'm, I've made my own cards in the past, but as you can see, it's not easy to get the papers or the cards to make the big ones. So, um, oh, and I just thought, actually, maybe you don't know what I mean when I say flipping. Let me just grab something. Hold on one sec. So, these are my flipping decoupage sheets. So, if I turn that round. So, I've got, so what you do is you have this. So, this sits on the back of your card. So, that sits on there. And then you put your aperture in the middle bit and then you decoupage the front of your picture to the front. But you've got the back as well. So you decoupage on the back as well. So, uh, yes, yeah, so I've got loads of those. Um, <laughs> Granddad on the toilet, um, in the garden, having a beer, um, doing a bit of fishing. Um, yeah, all sorts. Golf. And then there's the flipping women as well. So you've got, uh, you know, she's in the kitchen eating her cake, reading a magazine. Uh, the bigger ones as well. Like I say, I've got the big ones, which are those. But I've also got the little ones, which are those as well. So those 
two different size cards are going to be brilliant for me so yeah i just love the the flipping series i hate fussy cutting but <laughs> this is the one occasion where i will do fussy cutting because i just really like the idea of these i think they're so cute and now i've got that i might actually do this one for someone whose birthday is coming up and you've got all the uh sentiments on there as well so you can add that to your collection so yeah brilliant and actually have i got is that my teenager one there i think so let me just double check yeah yeah so you've got flipping teenagers as well <laughs> so some of them have got the um the background some of them haven't oh yeah look there's the flipping kids one which is the little kids the little cute kids on there as well which are great fun so oh that was a flipping man one there so i'll have to swap that over so let's put that back on my bookcase so yeah so those were 50p each and i've got that one as well which i think that's just a regular aperture card um but yeah it's always handy so let's pop that to one side and then the rest of what i got also 50 ph were a whole load of clarity stamps so some mounted some still in their original packets so i've got this one which um i don't know whether you can see it's a shoe and it's the twas the night before christmas so it was the night before Christmas when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse with the, the little shirt. And I think I think those. I can't say it's difficult. I'm not sure whether those are mice in the shoe or whether they're little presents. There was this, which is an absolutely gorgeous. Um, uh, what do they call it? Blossom branch. Um, beautiful blossom. Then there's this one, which is, um, it's a bauble with a, a house in it. And that says something that I can't read. <laughs> uh, midday to objects below. I can't, no, I can't read that. I'll have to stamp that one out and say. Then I've got this one, which is a window which is always really really useful you stamp that and then put things on there or you can cut the window out and have it looking over something there's a thinking of you which i don't think i've got one of these yet so the thinking of you and then there's the two birds which are always great for on your background cards so and these are all already mounted they're stuck on you can't take those off they're they're pretty well stuck on there so you've already got your clarity stamps and i do like these um these acrylic block stamps i think they they work really well you hold that press down and then you press with your, your other hand on your image there so those are the ones that are already mounted and then you've got these ones which were <clears throat> in packaging um with the instructions so you to turn these stamps into remountable simply peel off both the white paper and the adhesive tape underneath it will automatically stick to a clarity perspex mount when you want to change images clean the stamp blah 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 anyway so you've got the stamp and then you've got all the paperwork with it as well so and these are really I and mean, clarity are really really thick heavy duty stamps and then you've got the it's never obviously never been used because it's still got the the mount paper at the back so i can either use it like that or i might get myself a couple of these and see maybe using it so may the peace may peace be your gift at christmas i think which is a lovely sentiment really beautiful so there's that one there's this one which reads we make a living by what we get we make a life of what we give from winston churchill so again another unused 
um, stamp, fully taped, with the, um, it's stuck to the paper, but never mind, there we go, so really another really thick, really durable um, stamp, 50p, <laughs> and what else was that? There was this one, which is May the Wonder That Is Christmas Touch the Child Within Your Heart. So there's that one. Again, unused with the paper um, stuck on the back still. So that they, these are brand spanking new, these ones. And then the new design, Clarity Stamp. Together we can handle anything, which I think is also a good one for my um for journals and um, albums and stuff again brand spanking new on there and at 50p each so that's one two three four five pound these were 50p each as well but she charged me six pounds for everything so i got basically i got two packs or two stamps for free so, uh, yeah, so very, very pleased with today's, oh, where'd that come from? <laughs> with today's uh, visit to the car boot sale. Um, and I did think I was walking away with nothing crafty at all today because, like I say, there was very, very little there. I did see some, do you remember the, uh, what do they call them? Snowflakes, you know, the bead snowflakes. I did see the wires to make them um, but she wanted quite a lot for them so I thought I'm not paying a ton for them um, you know I think it was about three or four pounds she wanted for ten I thought that's a bit steep so I didn't I left those but yes yeah, so I'm very very pleased with my clarity stamps um, that I picked up today and I'm sure some of these I mean they're mounties but I don't think they've been used because you've still got that um the blue is still very clear and crisp on them, whereas some of them that has been used, so that one has been used, and you've got the black ink on it, so let me just show you. So, yeah, so I think some of these have never actually been used. Anyway, that was today's car boot. Um, really pleased. I think uh, six, seven, eight, nine pound nine pound in total and i got all of that not bad <laughs> anyway i've now got to find somewhere to put all this up so um, i'm gonna uh, end the video here and um, i will speak to you all soon so take care bye for now